Creating a bridge. Select bridge from the placement tools. The bridge placement settings dialog opens. Set the bridge template by browsing within the bridge folder. Set the superstructure type to pre-stressed girder. Click Show Advanced if it's not already shown. Set the BIM girder to Ashto Type 4 by browsing within the High Girder folder and typing in the search bar. Enable the Wing Walls checkbox and place the bridge. To do so, click on the freeway to place the start and the end of the bridge. Now edit the profile. Use element selection to select the bell road. Once selected, the profile displays in the action center. Edit the bell road profile so it closely follows the existing ground. Select the vertical alignment and move existing PVI. Add a new PVI to the bell road profile so it closely follows the ground. Position the cursor where the new PVI will be located. Right click and select insert PVI. Now edit the freeway profile. Select the freeway in the main scene and add three new PVI to where the profile will curve over the bell road. To see the new PVI, select the vertical alignment again. If necessary, the PVI can be selected and moved to the desired position. Zoom to the area of the bridge over bell road and adjust the freeway profile above bell road. To do so, select the double arrows to move the tangent section vertically so the freeway is above Bell Road. Now let's edit the bridge. Rotate and zoom to view the bridge. Select the bridge and review the bridge properties by clicking the information icon along the right side. Hide the bridge deck to make the pier easier to see and manipulate by clicking on the Hide Selected Items from the Selection Tools. Rotate the piers to be parallel with Bell Road. Move the pier using the arrow manipulators. Once completed, set the camera orientation to top view and adjust bridge abutments. Rotate and position the abutments to be parallel with Bell Road. Select one of the abutments. Manipulator appears to rotate the abutment. And repeat for the other abutment. 